Hi guys, it's me, Taylor Reads here, and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 4 Part 1. So I'm going to tell you guys a little bit about myself first when I'm eating my pudding. Um, first of all, on YouTube I make Let's Reads, aka Taylor Reads. Yeah. Right now I'm doing a couple of them. I'm doing... Let's read Vampire Academy Shadow Kiss, which I haven't recorded the first part of. And then I'm doing Let's Read The Long Elite by Maureen Liu. And then I'm doing Let's Read Looking for Alaska by John Green. Currently what I'm doing, I'm also going to start reading four after I finish Looking for Alaska, because that's relatively a short book. So yeah. That's me. I, well, be, I am just a regular girl. I love video games and I love reading. So I'm pretty much a nerd, but I love my, I love makeup and I love outfits, really. So I'm kind of like a girly geek gamer girl. Hmm. Nerd. I think that's right. Mm -hmm. Currently, I am 13 years old, so I'm probably going to look back at this and be like, ew, what's wrong with me? I don't know. I'm 5'4", and I've got brown hair and blue eyes. Although most people think I have dirty blonde hair. So, yeah. When I grow up, because I'm not even in high school yet, I want to be an author. I love writing. I love reading. It just kind of goes together. So, yeah. That's me, so let's get into this let's play now if you're bored. You know, like half of you have already signed off already, but don't stay here, please. This is our first sim, Lara Love. She is like our mama. I love her. She is super cute, I don't think. And I have this glitch. Oh, they, it, it's, it's fixed. So they're married already, and I'm gonna have to put a ring on her. But they're young, so. Let's put on a ring. Ah. This giant diamond ring. Yes, guys. Yes. Okay. So this is Lara Love. And to me, she is perfection. I absolutely love her. I love all the custom content I have on her. I love her eyes. I love her. She's just... Sorry, let me just... I don't know why I didn't fix that before. I swear to God, I fixed that. <gasps> Whatever. Um, I apologize if you can hear my family. They're a little cray cray and they're loud. I come from a German family, so they're probably gonna interrupt my video more than once. My dogs have already interrupted it, and I have a German Shepherd, so like it's German all around the house. Trust me. So I, so this is our first sim, and I do have a very bad mouse, so you will hear like the clicking and stuff. Yeah. I kind of have that really loud. I'll fix that in the next part. But this is Lara. This is her everyday attire. She, I love the heels and I love this outfit. I think it's really cute for the summer. Her formal attire is just this. She's got a tattoo and though there's a reason she got the tattoo. This is her athletic attire. You can kind of see another tattoo of her, of hers. Her sleepwear. Her party attire, custom content, and her swimwear. Um, Lara wants to be a best-selling author, like me. Um, she is outgoing, ambitious, and creative. She, to me, I love her to death. I literally, I created her messing around, and this is who we ended up with. Lara is kind of always that outgoing, outspoken spoken girl that you always see and yeah she's definitely that girl she's outgoing outspoken she really does she loves everything she is a girly girl no matter what she loves her makeup she loves this she loves that um she was raised in a single parent household after her dad passed away sadly in a car accident um lara she never really knew her dad, so she was only, as it said in Legends, she wasn't 
when she cried, she wasn't sad because he was gone. She was sad because she didn't have any memories of him and she couldn't make it. And But growing up with her mom, she definitely had a lot of love in her life. With She's the youngest of four. She had her big sister and she has her big sisters to look up to. And really, they raised her and she had an a perfect life cheerleader homecoming queen everything you would want to be straight a student got on the honor roll and everything yeah so that's laura <laughs> yep laura gaba that is her voice um she has the feminine walk which is absolutely perfection i love it she is married to Jonathan Love, who I will s show you in a minute. She's a young adult, and she's Lara. She had the perfect life without her dad. There's nothing really drastic that has happened to her ever. Here's Jonathan Love. Um, I'll, I'm doing something. Okay. So this is Jonathan. I love him, too. He's super cute. That This is his everyday attire. Love it. I'll show you it from a 360 angle. Uh huh. Formal attire. Cute, cute, cute. Athletic attire. Super cute. Sleepwear. Hot. Love him. Party attire. Swimwear. And that's really it. Um, that's it for the creative sim. I will see you guys when we enter the town. Hey guys, and welcome back. This is the towns we have to choose from. We have Willow Creek. Um, we are going to move to this one of these two. I haven't decided yet. But you will see that. I just want to show you the towns. And Oasis Springs. Oh, I didn't tell you Jonathan's backstory. I will insert that in the description. Low, I just hit my elbow below. Um, yeah, this is those are the towns, and I will see you guys when I'm finished building. We have 22,000 simoleons left, and I'll see hey guys, you welcome back to play. Let's Play The Sims 4. Yay, I'm excited. We are in the town of we are playing in Willow Creek for this, and I would have to travel to show you it, but you saw it in the beginning like a little second ago, but anyway. This is our little Sim family. We live right by the Goths, so I think that's going to be really cute. I like that. I love it. Okay, the Goths, if you don't know, are like my favorite family in the Sims, period. Anyway, everywhere, I like I either marry Mortimer or, but no, I just marry Mortimer. That's what I do, so I can get, like, all the money. I don't know. But since they are married, I can't really do that, so. Sorry, John. <laughs> okay. Anyway, I'm going to give you a little house tour, so let's go into tab mode. I need to build a pretty neat house, I think. We still have got a pretty decent amount of simoleons left. So this is our house. It is super cramped and super tiny, but I like it. I, I find it really cute okay i feel like that's good computer stay stay with me so this is our little living room i don't know it's really cute i guess um it will be expanded hopefully um our little dining room nothing really special over in here is the bathroom I didn't really do anything special in here. I had a little few decor items that we had a little bit of simoleons for. I do have pretty mm, nice stuff in here, but, you know, it's nice, I guess. Um, yeah, over here is, I'm going to show you the kitchen, and then I'm going to show you the bathroom. Over here is the kitchen. I literally picked out a kitchen and went with it. I rolled with it. Um, I picked out a kitchen from, like, the bill mode area, and it is super tiny and cramped, but I feel like it looks really good and neat for, like, just a starter kitchen. You know, we will expand it a lot, and, yeah. And now the bedroom, which I find it super girly, but, you know, that's my opinion. It's girly, and that's where she'll be writing, and, you know, it's her room. Who cares, right? Yeah. 
he just sleeps in it. He doesn't really do anything. And I know I gotta get him. I'm just gonna have him go jogging. So, yeah, that's our. There we go. Um. So we're in the game now. This is really, really cute. Like I love it to death. I'm sorry, I just gotta text some people. But I've got like five favorites on Twitter. Okay, so let's get into it. Um. I don't know what to do because it's just like the first part and it's really awkward. So I guess we could play for a little bit. Um, what are we going to do? I think we're going to get jobs first. So I'm going to have her get her job really quickly. So find a job. And I'll show you the new jobs that came with the update even though you probably saw them already. And disclaimer, I do not... Okay. I do not have the outdoor retreat stuff back. Okay, my debit card, I left it at my aunt's house, so I'm going to have to go pick it up there, and then order the outdoor retreat, and then download it, and then I'll do an, an entire video on it. Do not worry, guys. It'll be cool. Trust me. Okay. So sit down. Oh, I didn't press it right. Okay. Sit down really quickly. They're just going to start their lives. So, sorry about my dogs. They bark at everything you're just gonna have to deal with it i hate them so much are they done okay so there's the business career but she will be in the brighter career synergy efficiency plan planfulness if the mere sound of industry and buzzwords gets you buzzing then a career in business might just be the right fit for you career branches management and investor now hiring a mailroom technician yep that's what we have and then there's the athlete career which jonathan will be in an athlete requires physical strength speed endurance and intelligence start a career where where enthusiastic fans will shout out your name, wear your jersey, and remember your feats forever. Career Ranch is professional athlete and bodybuilder. He's going to be a professional athlete, though, but she's going to be a writer. So, this is what she is, Laura. Laura's going to be a writer. Okay. Get paid to express your ideas with beautiful turns of phrase and words. Wonderful words. Career Branches, author and journalist. She will be in the author. They're not hiring a writer's assistant and it's 25 simoleons an hour. So, yep. It is really loud. I'm going to fix that right now. Audio. And yeah, yeah. That's kind of loud. Let's just do 25. Apply changes. Boom. Boom. So, she just has to read books, but I saw their original book. Okay. Sorry, guys. And I got them a nice little this for, like, if Lara is just home and she's getting inspired and I don't really want her to write that moment, I'll just have her do that. Um, she's, right now, we're just going to watch some action. I don't know. I feel like I could watch action movies. And no, and no. So, and then you're going to find a job, Mr. Athlete, bodybuilder. Work out for a total of eight hours. Go to the gym. Go out on the gym venue. Okay. You are going to be an athlete. I already read it. They're not hiring a water person for 16 simoleons an hour. And he's off tomorrow. So, we'll probably have him go. Jonathan is now a water person at some sports team. He starts Tuesday at 2 p.m. So he'll probably... Yeah, I'm just going to have him go drink energy juice. Go jogging. Just go jogging for right now. Her um, For her work, acquire the fitness skill. I'm going to read this really quickly. Jonathan's new skill in fitness will allow him to perform various workouts on the workout equipment as the skill level increases. More advanced exercise routines will become available. Um, I'm going to have her write. Practice writing. We're just going to have her practice writing for a little bit. And, yeah. I 
find this like I find this like really super I love this house it is super adorable and this neighborhood I love it like we can go I know oh that's a pretty house who lives here like they can become our besties oh no we can't go there I like this area really it's really gorgeous I love this town so much Super pretty, super gorgeous. Yeah, who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Who that? Who that? Ah, GGY, my name. I think I recognize him. Is that Noah? No, that's Vercram. The Cram. I am like insulting some people. The Cram Palmer. Whatever, guys. Whatever. The thing is, this. Right here, this, this is maternity wear, I, like, Jesus. So, Jonathan yeah, is good. back from his workout. Uh, I don't think you're in here every day. It didn't look like it for a second there. So it's only 10.20 a.m. and there is enough room on this lot to the point where we can, like, extend this and, like, I could like make a nursery right here no like 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 right here maybe yeah right here and then have the door right yeah it, it's it's a house guys don't judge it so i think this is gonna be the end of this part by the next part art woo art woo art woo art woo, art woo. okay this is the end of this part i will see you guys next time just and I will am what I'm gonna do, it's like the question of the day that I will answer off of Ask FM. My Ask FM is will be in the link below if you wanna ask me questions. I don't know. Um what is your all-time favorite song? Take me to church. I love it. I love it. It No wait, no, no. You and I, like the one I can listen to all the time and never get sick of it is Clyde by Howie Day. Oh, I love it. Okay. Yep, that's our, that's the question. I hope you guys enjoyed this part. I love you guys. Bye.